sink. On the last time of the binding of Isaac, I got my ass handed to me by mom's heart. That was quite unfortunate, and I'm sorry it had to be such a half episode, but uh, now we're going to try a little something different, with a different objective in mind. We're going to be playing as Isaac, with the goal here, not to clear the game, but merely to try and live long enough to unlock some more characters. Actually, and uh, I mentioned unlocking stuff, and I want to clear that up. What my main goal with this Let's Play is, um, as you may know, the bind uh, Binding of Isaac, Wrath of the Lamb has been released, and, uh, <clears throat> oh, I got hit already. I want to show that off as soon as I can, but what I want to do before that is show off unlocking most of the game before that. Here we have a new item. This is the deck of cards. This will give us a random tarot card every time it's used. So it's a pretty good find. Uh, I don't think that there would be an there would be an item shop on this level, but with it being so early, it's not a good use of it. I am just going to show all the bosses clearing the game with all the characters. Not necessarily getting stuff like the Golden God, or trying to, uh, <clears throat> or trying to get all the items. I think I said that already. Yeah. I, I think I did. And, uh, that's what we were going with Eve. And that we weren't necessarily trying to finish the game. Well, that's exactly what we're trying to go. I, I can't even talk straight. I'm sorry, folks. <laughs> no, I'm not sorry, because this is too damn fun. What, that's what I was trying to do with Eve. I was just trying to clear the game to... Well, that is one of the parts of the unlocks that I'm trying to get. Just clearing the game with all the characters. And this time, in addition to trying to clear the game, we're gonna try and unlock the characters, if the game will give us the luck. We didn't have the best... I guess we did have pretty good luck. I just didn't play to my best. And this is letting me play to my best here, right now. But I'm gonna save that. Because it's not enough to get a full priced item. And I'd rather save that, uh... That one key for the next level. Now, let's go on! <clears throat> Larry Jr. Is one is shorter than the other. Well, that's new. The reason why I'm choosing Isaac is he has more health and a little more survivability than Eve does. And uh, he also starts with that bomb. We already picked up two, so we have more than we started with than we should originally, but yeah. Getting those getting that level one secret room and up to nine Come on, I no. Larry! Stop moving around, I'm trying to hit you! Be a good worm. And be squashed. Like you're supposed to. I feel like I've... I actually haven't been playing... This isn't recorded too close together. So I feel like my performance has suffered since I haven't had much time to practice. It's kind of like, oh... I can't really practice at this after all. It's... Either I record it or just sit there, eat some dog food, and uh, screw up the save file. There is no do-overs. Ooh, this is a new one. Wait, no it's not. That's right, it's not! Heh <laughs> In the second floor? Wait, let's use the stars right away. Oh, this is a good one. The rosary! I not sure if it does anything more than just gives us three soul hearts. Huh. I'll have to look that up. Or maybe I can show it in the game. Up. Up. Oops. This one's an annoying one to hit. God dang it! Scabbish! Better give me more soul hearts, man. Yep, you're dead. You're dead. Just 
face. The High Priestess. Nope, but that's a good attacking card. And I think I'm gonna use that in the next annoying room. Just because now that I have the deck of cards, it can come in handy. High Priestess is a very nice card. It summons your mother's foot to stomp on the enemies. Yeah, that's all it does. But it does a pretty good amount of damage. Here, there might be a secret room here, so let's bomb this. And we get two coins as well, so double the money. Woohoo! I'm in the money. I'm in the money. Ya da 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 ya ba da da your skull. That face looked like a. That, those rocks looked like a skull to me. This is really laggy for some reason. And I can't stop the computer to check out. Oh well. Hmm. Whatever. You know, it's just going through. As long as I manage to come up with something witty or funny to say. Unfortunately, therein lies the hard part. Oh! Hello. Is this... Oh my gosh, it is. It's the Bible, guys. I'm totally saving this because this makes killing mom a piece of cake. There is no cake in here, but this is a piece of cake now. And I can do the life donation machine because there's plenty enough of hearts to go around. Give me money. 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 Woo! That's super money! Double super money. Woohoo! Mom's pill bottle has appeared in the basement. Forgot about that. If you donate enough stuff to a donation machine, you get that. And I don't know why that uh, heart was there. Actually, what I think I'm gonna do here, folks, is I'm just gonna speed this up. Because this can go on forever. And there you have it, we finally got the blood bag, and increased our health. Lovely, isn't it? And, uh, I want to save this money, especially since we can then go up here, and buy ourselves that mushroom. Aha! We're now super tiny and super speedy. And then we can still buy something else! See how that's wonderful? That blood donation machine can really do wonders, can it? And this should hopefully do wonders for us. Okay, as far as the Bible, it also has a use outside of uh, just using it for an easy kill on your mother. When you use it, you can fly around the room, and I think it takes six rooms to recharge. Uh, but it will be a useful item when, uh, like, those dick rooms that they stick us with. Or like famine here. Well, no, not really famine. It doesn't do the weapon thing. Oh! High Priestess! Was just wasted, because I'm a stupid fool. Because of his charge there, he, uh... ran out of the range of the foot. And I am playing it safe in this fight. This is that tactic I mentioned the last time we fought famine. Just stay in front of him all the time. Try not to get hit. And, uh, he only spawns so many of the flies of Grandpa variety. And then he'll just charge you. And he flew unusually far. Charge! Nope. Sometimes the flies will fly away, and he won't destroy them. Like there, I think I hit that fly away. And he should destroy that? Nope. Wow. Up. 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 And here we go, phase two. Hey. Hey. Hate it. Hey. A dodge and fire. Dodge and fire. I am a hobbit. 
Not a hobbit? What do they call him? Midget! I'm Midget Isaac! And now we have the makings of Meat Man. Started. Cube of meat. What do we got in here? We have the Pact and Ouija. Um. Believe it or not, folks, I'm actually not gonna take these. Because I'm gonna try to unlock the character Magdalene that unlocks by having enough hearts. Satan! I reject you! Satan! I reject you! Satan! Why did you lock me in this chest for rejecting you? He does lots of crazy stuff. Blind as a Batman in here. That's what these guys are. At least I have the Cuba meat. If we get lucky. Okay, as far as the Cuba meat and those horsemen. The I there is a book you can get. It looks very much like the uh like the Bible. It's uh, actually technically a condensed version of the Bible. It's the Book of Revelations. It's a looks just like the Bible except it's black. And I gotta be careful here or my talking's gonna get me killed. Not killed, damaged. What the Book of Revelations does, you use it and it generates soul hearts. It also makes it more likely that the uh, four horsemen appear. I'm thinking that maybe that the cross, uh oh, the rosary increases the chances for that and I've got to try and angle my tears here which I'm not too good at because there's just too m many of these guys shooting sideways. Okay now that that guy's gone, maybe I can get a little easier here. Yep there's one down. I've actually never... I've uh, gotten no damage on only two areas. Is there anything in here? Yeah, I'll chance it. Because money's always good. Oh, shoot! That was too fast. I was not fat. Was it too fast or was I not fast enough? I think I was too distracted. Because I didn't know what was going to show up. The caves and the depths are the two areas that I have never no damaged. I've gotten no damage on the basement and the womb, but that's all. Grabbins! What? No grabbing for you. Listen to that dangerous music. That's what these guys are. Danger incarnate. I should really look for some rain... Uh, fire right up, that's it. See? Um, that's actually the tactic that I was talking about. Damage them all so where you can easily hunt them down. Then they can stop following you. And whatever one's in the lead, you can quickly take out before the others respawn. It takes a while, but it's uh, one of the best ways to deal with these guys, especially when you're low on health. Uh-oh. Oh. I did not mean to do that. I did not mean to do that. Whoa, I knocked you further down. These guys really are the source of one of the biggest banes of the game. I just hate that it spawned with the one that follows you. <sighs> I don't think that was worth it. In the end, it wasn't even worth it. I'm gonna chance this secret room and win! Unicorn horn! I'm not even gonna pick it up because. Yeah. I got my Bible, and that's all I need. Here we're gonna show up the Bible! I can float! I get not demon wings, but angel wings! Because I want to help out this poor unfortunate soul. I am his guardian angel. And. Blood of the Martyr! Damage up! My tears turn bloody, and I get the thorn crown. How fitting is that? You can see it only lasts for one room, which is unfortunate, but... Can be used to overcome those certain rooms. Since I already got damaged, though, I don't have to worry about that as much. But I still have to worry, because I can still get hit, and still lose enough life points. That's where the point is that I'm about to maybe die. Not gonna get you, not worth spending the bomb. Ooh, I did choose the right door! 
Woohoo! Dodged you. Hold on, hold on. Yep, yep. Nope. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yep. Nope. Hold on, hold on. Yep. Nope. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Come on. Yep. There we go. Hold on. Yep. 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 Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, host. Three hits. Thank you. Thank you all. Thank you very much. Let's see what's in here now, folks. Woo! We're at Dr. Jesus! Uh, my life bar flashed. I'm not sure what that did, but... And the blood bag seems to override the doctor mouth. The doctor mask. Um, we got the PhD, which turns pills into better pills. And I'm actually going to see if I can't get more bombs here. So then I can get that. And because of that blood of the martyr, I can get more damage up. I'm actually surprised that you can get... I got the blood of the martyr so soon. Last time... Their last playthrough, it, uh... Came rather difficultly to me. You know what? I can afford... Let's see what we get. Speed up. Very nice. In addition to only getting good items through the doctor PhD, you also know exactly what the items are the moment you pick them up. Isn't that wonderful? It's a good thing that I'm going to sped up through that, otherwise we would have been here longer. There's no way to get that. Up, oh, chargies. Up, oh, there goes my soul heart. Woo, that was close. Thank you, blood of the martyr. Nope. Nope. And here we have one, two, three. Well, let's check it out anyways, since I got extra keys. Teleport and uh, that thing. Tarot card. Nope, we don't need it. Nope. Nope. Now to fight the boss. Cro I'm hoping that I get some kind of food stuff. Because then I can unlock uh, Mary. Chub! This guy again. Wow. Woo! Run out of the way. Sorry about that spike. I just get so excited with playing video games and almost getting hit. Nope, nope. These guys are nope. Whoa! Just sneaked in through there. Oh, you're pooping out babies. You're pooping out two babies at once. I swear, I don't remember you pooping out two babies at once. Well, this is gonna take a little longer than usual. I better focus on Chubb himself, huh? And not focus on the lagomorphic rific proportion. That's probably one of my catchphrases. Describing anything laggy as lagomorph. Lagomorphic. Two at once! That's no fair. One absorbs the hits of the other! Okay, you know what? Hey! Beast! Whoa! That really took down his life. I am surprised how much that did. I don't usually rely on that. I wonder if that was like some kind of boss. Yeah, I mean, champion version. Hooray, food! And we haven't unlocked her yet? Huh. I think it's you gotta get your life points over a certain level. But anyways, before we go down, I am gonna say goodnight and start a new video. This is Angry Squirrel, see you guys later.